Hey YouTube, welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to look at a spooky fishing tourney full of treats coming very soon to Animal Crossing Pocket Camp. So without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. So right now we are pretty much at the end of the recent Eevee themed Pokeball scavenger hunt event as well as the latest host and most. Of course the scavenger hunt scattered hundreds of Pokeballs all around our camps which we could collect and craft time limited Eevee and Pokeball themed items. By now I'm sure everyone has seen the invasion of giant inflatable Eevees taking over everyone's camps. The host most event is almost over too, having introduced 5 brand new villagers with some new clothing and furniture items. As always the event also had some timed goals running alongside it with some awesome rewards so if you're quick there's still time to grab a few extra leaf tickets for inviting some new villagers to your camps if you haven't already. Now with these events almost over and the Halloween weekend fast approaching, we don't have long to wait for another spooky event to begin. Beginning in just a few days time on the 23rd of October, the 7th fishing tourney will begin this time back at Lost Lure Creek. Just like previous tourneys, it is expected to last for around a week ending on the Halloween weekend which as always gives us plenty of time to catch some brand new river fish and of course trade them in with Chip this time for some spooky goodies. This time around with it being around the Halloween celebrations, the event will introduce some tasty candy fish including the adorable orange candy fish, the melon candy fish and the slightly rarer grape candy fish. The event will follow the same trends as previous events as Chip will be on the lookout for as many fish as we can catch and offering up some randomly awarded prizes. I'm sure you're all used to how it works by now but basically the goals we reach are based on the collective length of all the fish we take to him so the more fish we catch the happier Chip is and the more prizes we can earn. Now it can't really be a Halloween event without some creepy costumes to help celebrate the holiday. Some of the prizes up for grabs include the bone shirt, the jack-o-lantern tee which is kind of creepy, the count's jacket, the bone cap, the horned headband, the count's top hat, the jack-o-lantern hat, the bone pants and finally an all new spooky tawny banner which will look great in a Halloween themed campsite. With this event being themed around a holiday it's unlikely we'll be getting any tanked version of these fish to place in our campsites which sucks but it's still a tawny so the wooden, bronze, silver and gold fishing trophies will still be rewarded. As always some tawny throw nets will be available and of course the golden fishing rod can also be rented during the event for the usual 80 leaf tickets if we want to catch as many fish as possible. Personally I never used to use the golden rod but I have for the last couple of events because it does make it a lot easier especially if like me you miss a few rotations throughout the day. Of course it's still possible to complete the event without it so if you're just playing for fun or you usually manage to catch a bunch of rotations it's probably not worth renting, I would save your leaf tickets for something else. So yeah definitely some cool prizes up for grabs this time, the jack-o-lantern tee is definitely a favourite for me, so yeah that pretty much covers all the latest news surrounding Animal Crossing Pocket Camp right now, as always if you'd like even more updates don't forget to head over to my Patreon at patreon.com forward slash mayamori. Of course I would like to thank every single supporter over there, it means the world and you really help make these videos happen. Anyway, if you got this far in the video, please comment candy just to let me know you did, that would be super awesome and be sure to include if you're still enjoying the fishing tourneys. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video and found it entertaining, please be sure to leave a like if you did. Thanks for watching, I hope you have an amazing day and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.